if I ask somebody to move and they don't want to move, these big old um, wheels will just get run over their feet. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. And if you're not, like I said, welcome back. In today's video, we are, my oh, breath. In today's video, we are um, unboxing and putting up um, my travel system that came this morning. It came really fast, by the way, because I ordered it, I think we ordered it yesterday, morning afternoon and it came this morning a little after 10 this morning so that was good because it was free next day delivery i'm out of breath i did order the um i think it's the kinder kinder craft move three in one travel system so obviously it comes with the frame it comes with the um the bassinet thingy that turns into the chair from when they're six months and the car seat and then this obviously it came with a mosquito net a rain cover and i think it came with a changing bag too um so that was this bundle they did have other bundles um and the only reason why i wanted one of the other bundles is because it came with a cup holder but this one didn't but the ones with the cup holders didn't have the color so i got in the color gray um yeah i know i ordered it quite early but it was actually on sale on kiddieskingdom.com so it was on sale for 219 pounds so I ordered it, so, but it's good that, you know, I got it a bit early so I can see whether I like it. And obviously if I don't like it, I can always send it back and still have time to find a new one. Um, this wasn't the one I wanted originally, but the one I wanted originally is not going to come by the end of January. So, um, can't get that one, obviously. But this one was my second favourite, so I'm glad it went on sale too. So, got that. And then... Yeah, just gonna unbox it make sure everything's in there make sure i like it set it up see how it is and if i like it then we're just gonna take it all apart put it back in the box and then put it in the villa where all the other baby stuff are so but let's get into Like I said, it's the Kinder Craft Move. Um, doesn't say. Oh, it says the stroller. I don't know if you can see. It says stroller, pam, pram body, which is the bassinet that turns into the seat. And then the car seat, which is there. And then obviously the frame. Um, I made this hole trying to drag it because the delivery driver left it in the front porch bit. And obviously I need it in house. As you can see, it's coloured grey as it says. <laughs> unzip it and take it off for cleaning purposes so i wonder if i can find online uh just a plain black one or even a gray one to order on its own so i can take this brown off and put a gray on but we'll see so that's it's the brown box here we have a wheel yo so let me tell a story I've purposely been looking for a stroller that has massive wheels and the reason for that is if I ask somebody to move and they don't want to move these big old um, wheels will just get run over their feet because I ask them to move they don't want to move because I know some people are so rude when they see someone with a pusher coming through and you say excuse me they don't want to move so this will get run over their little feet and then I don't want to hear them tell me nothing because I will come back and roll it back okay so i'm glad i got the wheels i didn't think it's gonna be this big but it's bigger than my head my gosh and i don't have a small head but i'm happy that it's big so this is the front wheel which again it's quite Big, ain't it? I think it's gonna be that big, but sorry. I don't know what this is. So here we have 
this must be the um this side anyway this must be the bassinet slash seat part yeah it's obviously the back but alice is gonna have to deal with that Here we have the car seat, almost as information. Um, heavy. Um, obviously, it comes with a newborn insert that went there, not newborn, and a bit bigger. You can obviously take it out. And yeah, so it's got that. Things are heavy. Here is the pusher frame. Here's the hood. And that is everything. Mm -hmm. So guys, I put up the car seat on my own. Stop the nose. So guys, I put the wheels on and attached the basket because I'm a pro like that. But um, this guy here wants to take over. So I had to teach him that the little thing on the front actually locks the wheels from turning. So again, I'm a pro. And I can't fix it up then. It has five different levels and it goes up as well. I'm not going to put you like that there. <laughs> So guys, I think um, it's really good that the car seat attaches to the frame. So if you was to be in a car and just need to quickly pop out to the shop, then um, obviously you can just take the car seat out of the car and just pop it onto the frame because the adapters are in the car seat already, which is really good. So guys, this is the pram in the bassinet mode and um, this is realistically what you're meant to use from when they are newborn till when they are about six months um obviously depending on your baby but that's the um time you're really meant to use it for it's good that um it has a soft base inside i don't know if you can see but the gray padding inside is really soft so that's really good for the baby so when if we do go over like bumpy roads or whatever um the baby's safe and secure it's got um the little clip harness thingy to harness you in so that's good because it means that the baby won't be flying about if you're pushing the push chair um, over something bumpy or in a rush or something so I think that's really good how they've done it So, 
so the good thing about the hood on this one is that obviously if you have it facing like it's not facing you whatever you have that little peep hole in there so when you put it down you can just see if the baby's okay um also if it's like really sunny or something or you don't want anybody to see your kid where the zip bit is if you unzip it it gives you like an extra hood bit so it's like more coverage for your kid pull it more so it just gives you that extra bit of coverage and then this hack that i love that i know a lot of pushers don't have if the sun is hitting from one direction and you kind of want to block out the sun from that direction you can fold you can partly fold in like half of the um the hood i don't know if you can see that though So it looks, it looks broken though, but it's a good hack. It's a good sun hack. So if you want part of the sun not to hit your kid's face, you can just open up that part of the hood and leave the other part of the hood down. So, this is what it looks like as a seat unit. And I really like it. I still put a blanket under there, but it's good. And it's just got the little name tag thingy on it, and that is nice. Then it comes with a mosquito net, but I've never known anybody who's going to actually use a mosquito net. So it's not even going to get used, to be honest. Then, I have the rain cloud. 